I don't think there was ever a specific moment or turning point where I knew I was different. I just was. If my hair could speak, it would probably scold me and complain about how much I've put it through. My hair has always been a big part of my identity. But sides, frosted tips, curled hair, box dye, (laughs) after box dye, after box dye, my hair has been through a lot and in many ways has really grown with me. I think hair is so personal, just as personal as how and what we choose to adorn our bodies with. It's a form of self-expression, and in many ways it's its own language. I remember the first time I ever got extensions. It was right before I came out, and I remember the hairdresser just in awe, saying and doing everything in his power to make me feel so beautiful. Ever since then, I do that hairstyle every single day. Soft waves, shiny locks, it just brings me back to that feeling. There was a huge sense of gender euphoria, complete bliss. And for the first time I looked in that mirror I saw me, and I never want to lose that feeling. I know for many people, doing your hair is just a part of your daily routine, nothing to ponder on or think twice about. My hair has truly given me the courage to live unapologetically. If my hair back then was my security blanket, today I wear it as my cape fearlessly, and just ready to take on the world. My name is Di Sabato, and this is my hair story. Happy Pride.